This tutorial shows the step-by-step -step instructions for this lesson in the Omega Learning Guide. To begin, you will need to open the file you saved at the end of the previous lesson. Click anywhere on the shape to select the entire design. Click Shape Absolute Size. Turn on Uniform and enter 10 inches in the Height text box. Click File Output All to send the file to GSP Plot. In GSP Plot, click File Save to Spool File. The Save to Spool File dialog box will open. Turn on the Print Information and Cut Information checkboxes. Turn on View Spool File to automatically open the Spool File viewer after you save it. Turn on Send File to Edge or Max to save an SPL file and output the information to a selected thermal printer. Click OK. The Save As dialog box will open. Navigate to the My Lessons folder. Type the name Salzburg if it is not already present as the file name. Enter the following text in the description box. Salzburg Museum Sign, Process Color, 10 inches high. Click Save. The job is then rendered as an SPL file. In GSP Plot, click File, View Existing Spool File. Navigate to the My Lessons folder and select the Salzburg SPL file. Click Open to open the file in the Spool Viewer program. Turn on Show White Space to see all the vinyl that will be used when printing the job. Navigate through each of the separations using the drop-down menu or the next previous foil buttons in the main menu. There is one separation for each of the four process colors and one for the cut information. Click File Print or click the Print button to send the job to a printer. Click File Cut or click the Cut button to send the job to a plotter. You can also use the File Menu commands in GSP Plot to print or cut spool files. This concludes this lesson. Be sure to check if there are any exercises or tip videos associated with this lesson before continuing. For more information on this and other topics, please consult the Omega Help file or press F1 in Composer.